What's poppin' yo, welcome back to another YouTube video. Today we're taking a look at the new LEGO Ninjago magazine issue number 20. Nope, issue number 91. Uh, that is the one we're taking a look at today. It is issue number 91 that does come with um, Dragon Kai. Dragon Kai is a character that I wanted to get from one of the uh, sets uh, that came out. It, it came in Cole's Boulder Kai, I do believe. But he has some nice translucent arms, some translucent legs, a translucent head and... A dual molded helmet and some dual molded wings with this gold and red glitter effect there. Um, he does come with this like sort of dagger sword thing, which isn't that clever. It isn't that cool. I don't really like this. Um, but it is a really cool figure. I like the golden armor on his chest, the golden wing suit that he has going on, and he does have this very excited facial expression when you do remove his mask. It, it is a red head. And it looks very cool. Kai is my favorite ninja, so now I have two fire ninjas. My two favorite ones, Jay and Kai. Um, Jay is the cheapest one to get, but now this is the cheapest one to get because it is in the magazine. Um, it looks pretty cool, and I hope that they put more of these in the magazines because they are quite expensive to get. But if I do remove the head and the wingsuit, you can get a better look at the back torso printing and the front torso printing here. Um as it is very cool and deserves a lot of looking at. There's a lot of explosions there. It has Kai sort of exploding back into wings there. Um, some nice armor at the front, which does sort of continue here uh, and then into the wings. You can remove these sort of kern pieces off the wings, um, but and maybe add something else on there if you wanted to, or like create a custom flyer. Uh, but these dragon things are very cool, and I, I do like how the ninja are turning into dragons, and I can't wait to see it in the actual series. Because the first 12 episodes are out now, uh, but I'm just waiting on the last few to come out, because I'm very excited for this season. It is supposed to be like the end game for Ninjago. But taking a look at the magazine, uh, the epic Lego toy is uh, Dragon Kai. Uh, there is a cool comic here, scrolling through. We have Dragon Cole, Dragon J, Dragon Zane. Uh, new Adventures for the Ninja um, looks pretty cool. Um, I had this conversation with Manana the other day that if Nia can turn into water, can Cole turn into rocks, can Zane turn into ice, can Kai turn into fire, and can Jay turn into lightning? And how would that work? Little instructions on how to build it, and then some information on uh, the ninja's sort of dragon outfits and their dragon sort of uh, vehicles. Jay is the only dragon version of himself to come with his own vehicle. Uh, Kai Dragon comes with that. Um, Cole's Dragon comes with that. And then Zane's Dragon comes with that. Because they come in all separate sets. So you got to collect them all. We have some bad guys, some games, some spot the difference, and then the comic. Huh. I'm glad you closed your dojo and came back to us, Kai. Maybe we can get the old ninja team back together, after all. Sorry, I am just debating whether I've read this comic before or not. No, I haven't, okay. <laughs> well, I'm not exactly thrilled about it. Uh, you should have seen me teaching all those boys and girls. No feeling fatigue. <laughs> if you want to be a ninja, you should have a hundred push-ups in your locker. Faster, faster. Remember, strike first, ask questions later. But if I tell you what those youngsters can't take very much, uh, one of them had to stop training early. I think he felt dizzy and unwell. He had visions of me as a ninja god. <laughs> Sounds like you're pushing them too hard. Uh, you have forgotten all Master Wu's wisdom, balance, and... Oh, sorry, a phone call. Pixel. Uh, hey, what's up? Duh. Mill orphans have detected strange vibrations on the seabed that they believe could pose a threat to their kingdom. Mysterious vibrations at sea? Good thing we're already down at the harbor. We'd better take a look. Oh, the ninja. Uh, back again? Uh, hello, Commissioner. Can we borrow one of your police boats, please? The ninja have saved our city from flood. Can borrow a boat from me any time. Uh, hey, let's go. Hop in. We're now roughly at the coordinates that Pixel gave us. Uh, <laughs> there's something over there. Switch to long distance vision. It's an oil drilling platform, and it's crawling with misdemeanors henchmen. Let's take a closer look. Cut the engine so they don't detect us approaching. 
sneak in without sound, and strike in the heart of the hornet's nest, ninja style, just like how I like it. Easy now, guys. First, assess the situation. Whoa, I've never seen so many of them in one place. <laughs> Who cares? A little elemental power, and they'll be down in no time. Oh no, please stay quiet, guy. <laughs> time for some elemental fire. You, uh... Oh, so that's what they're doing here. They're mining vegstone from the seabed. The... This reduces our probability of defeating them. This high number of enemies from... 100 to 17.5. Oops. <laughs> Maybe I should have stayed quiet. Get them. There are too many of them. <laughs> then give them all you got. <laughs> Don't worry. You'll all get a turn. This might take a while. With this, my many opponents. With this many opponents, this could take hours if we do not get some support around here soon. Boundless depths of the ocean are our home near. Uh, we have a little get the ninja's weapons. The dragon poster, which I quite like. I'm taking this poster and putting it in my room. Uh, design your own dragon wings for your own character. Uh, like You can literally design them, color them, play them with your own figures. Uh, a little more games and back. It's also the home to the underwater creatures where... They're guardians and protectors. There are many threats from land dwellers, and we have to stand up to them. If they continue to pollute and destroy our world, threats like this must be stopped. <laughs> uh, what's that noise? It's coming from the depth. Yes, tear it all down. This wasn't in the job description. <laughs> the entire rig! The entire rig, it's toppling. Hold on, tight. Oh no, I left my swimsuit at home. I thought yesterday was bath day. Back into the familiar depths. No, there goes my lunch bags. The vent stone is taking a dip. We can use our animal, our animal powers again. Don't even think about it. Think about what? You're staying exactly where you are. Exactly that. <laughs> and if you don't like it, cold, there's something a little warmer. How about a little earth to beat the seasickness? Now I want to get to the bottom of who's behind this whole thing. I'm getting out of here. Hey, he's trying to escape. <laughs> Not so fast, buddy. Maybe you can tell us... What this is all about? Uh, Mr. Mina wanted us to collect as much v v Vengestone as we can to sell it. And who is buying all the Vengestone? No one, none of us, n n no. We could tell the commissioner so he can keep an eye on all the other locations where Vengestone is being mined. <laughs> and we'd better focus on finding this mysterious buyer. That's the end of the comic, then we have another game... Uh, oh, like, a little questionnaire to send in to win some Ninjago prizes. We have an ad for the Marvel comics. And then we have, um, a little ninja thing. You sort of throw them around, I do believe. Oh, it's a little statue. Um, but the next one is Lloyd and does come out next time. It doesn't give us a specific date, but it does come out pretty soon. Um, so, yeah, that is Ninjago number 91, issue 91. I didn't read it. I read the Legacy one, but I'm back with the Ninjago comics. Uh, so, other than that, I hope you all enjoyed. See you all next one. Have a nice day, and goodbye. Stay home and stay safe.